Hey guys, what's going on? X-Force here, and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm just going to be playing Sky Wars and talking over it, but uh, yeah, if you enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, let's get into it. So yeah, I thought I'd just do a more laid-back, relaxed video, just talking about, like, you know, stuff that's happening for me, because recently I've been doing a lot of coding, etc., and I've just, I've been way more focused on that than on my channel, which I feel like has actually paid off for me, coding-wise, but obviously... I really, I really don't want to not focus on my channel at all because like I still, I still want to have my channel, I still want to be doing YouTube, but it's just that I've been doing so much coding recently that all my time's just gone into that, which you know, I don't really mind my time going into that, I actually really, really enjoy coding a lot, but as I said, like, I definitely, I want to keep doing YouTube, okay, I want to keep doing YouTube, but um, it's, it's kind of hard to combine the two because coding requires me to spend a lot of time just trying to figure out problems, solving them, etc. And like, that's something that I must also try and like learn to do together with YouTube, which is why I'm like kind of forcing myself to make this video, even though I obviously do want to make it. Like, I'm kind of forcing myself to make this video right now because I kind of, I, I just have to. I don't want to, I don't want to stop doing YouTube. But yeah, for my server though, on the other hand, I've been super active and like things have been so great, like th things are greater than ever. Like I've got a party system pretty much like on Hypixel and I'm about to add more features to that later. Um, it's just, okay, see the thing with the server that people do also mention to me a lot, like people always like keep telling me like, hey, if you are going to make a server and if you are like are going to invest time and money into it, like... Make sure that like you know the server is original and that people are gonna actually want to play on it, and that's actually a really fair point and like an argument that I'd personally make myself. Like, it, it servers need to be original if you want to keep players. Like, if you or aren't an original server, what is this guy doing? <laughs> oh, it's a good thing I've got TNT. Yeah, anyways, if a server isn't like original, then the chances of it succeeding is like pretty much next to none existent. Like, it's just you gotta have a good server, you gotta have original content, original games for that matter. Like, just just an original take in some games would be enough as well. I think I, I really don't know what I'm planning to do exactly for this server yet, which is the problem. Currently, I've got Skywars fully coded, and as I said, like, I've got a party system created. But yeah, it's kind of difficult to figure out where I'm going to be going with the server from this point on because it's kind of, it's kind of tricky. Like I need to think of something that people will enjoy while at the same time also thinking about things that are, you know, realistic because I am fully coding this on my own. I'm, I'm very proud of where I've gotten so far, but if I'm going to keep coding this on my own, it's going to be like taking a lot of time and a lot of effort from me. And then... I kind of want to make sure, I, I kind of want to guarantee that there's like, you know, some something in return, I guess. I don't, I don't know how to put it. Like, I, I kind of, I need to guarantee a player base, I feel like. That's the first thing I've got to do. But yeah, I'm still looking for developers, I'm still looking for builders. Like, we are so early on in the stage of this. Like, it's just, it's incredibly difficult to find people. Like, have you ever thought about, like, I don't know if people actually have already done this in the... I don't want to talk about that. I don't know if any of you have done this in the past, but like finding a builder or finding like staff for that matter, it's really, really difficult. Like I want to make sure that any staff that I accept is like trustworthy. So I'm like putting people in the trial stage and stuff right now, but it's just, it's super, it's super fragile, you know, like for me personally, like I, I've never actually looked for staff for a Minecraft server. So I have no clue where I'm supposed to look for people like I, I really have no clue uh but yeah, anyways let's try and kill this guy yeah so make sure that the server has like some kind of a success i guess like i gotta make sure that the staff team's good that we have like good game modes etc so i'm trying to think of more but at the same time i'm also thinking i need a way to like actually advertise this because like you know obviously those are the ways to keep the players in the in the server like keep them playing on the server but there also, you know, has to be the initial getting the players to join the server, um, which is also not easy, by the way. Like, you need a lot of advertisement, and for that, you know, the, the only people that are actually, like, easy advertisers, I, I say easy because, like, it's just, they're, they can easily reach out to other people, but, like, just influencers overall, 
like they can easily reach out like I could reach out to my fan base but I don't think I'd get a lot of response but you know obviously other youtubers slash streamers they can reach out and they can like get more people on the server but obviously that's not that's not simple as well because you know you first of all like I mean having to like proving that my server is like decent that's not really a big issue like I've done that with a few youtubers already not really offering them anything though but like um, I've done that with a few YouTubers already, just showing them, like, what my server is capable of so far, but it's, it's difficult because they have to put, they have to also put a leap of faith into your server and hope that you're going to be doing well, and, like, th that's the, that's the complex part, like, I, I need to convince YouTubers that, like, my server will actually not be, like, a scummy server or anything, which, you know, th that's one of the things that I would personally also think of, like, I would also want to make sure that a server that I'm promoting is a good server that I would actually want to play on. So I, I need to reach out to more YouTubers. But to be honest, I'm kind of lacking inspiration on which YouTubers I need to contact because I'm like, I've, I've contacted a few of my friends, of my YouTuber friends, but like not really like anyone that I don't know yet, which I feel like I should probably do. But at the same time, see, it gets super... Oh, I'm lucky. <laughs> that just didn't blow up my bridge, okay. Um... I don't quite know what this guy's doing. Is he, like, stuck there? Or... Is he fine? Yeah, he was, he was definitely not fine. Yeah, I think the most likely response that I'm going to get when I'm reaching out to YouTubers is going to be that they want to see some kind of payment. And like, to be honest, I don't blame them because like, that's that's fair, you know? You, I mean, you're not going to be promoting a server for free, but at the same time, you're constantly promoting Hypixel, which, you know, obviously it's one of the biggest servers and they actually enjoy playing on it. But like, I feel like sometimes YouTubers do not give servers a fair chance, but that aside, I think most YouTubers will expect some kind of payment and the only issue is that, you know, the server's obviously not up yet, so we don't have any, like, donators for the server. Please don't hit me off. We don't have any donators for the server yet, like, we, we don't have anyone that's purchased a rank or whatnot yet, so it's kind of, it's, it's difficult because everything that I would be investing would either come, well, it would all come from what I've earned from YouTube, which is, you know, that's difficult to, oh. It's difficult to trust that the server is going to do well. I mean, personally, I think the server is going to do well, but to be putting money into things right now is fragile because I see the opening of the server in like two or three months when like a lot more has been coded, when we've hopefully got some more developers and stuff. Like, I don't, I don't know. I currently do not see the server releasing yet because of like how like early on it is in terms of like I mean I've got Sky Wars and that's working like a charm but there's a lot more features that need to be added if I want to make it a original and if I want to make it be like entertaining for players to actually play because original content obviously does not directly mean that the players will actually want to keep playing it and somehow I just won okay yeah, overall, I think the server will do well. It's just a matter of, like, whether it's going to keep doing well, I guess. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I really don't know what to expect. Like, it's super fragile to be putting money into the server right now. Like, I haven't actually gotten anything in terms of, like, um, a server IP or whatever. Like, I really... I don't want to do that kind of stuff yet because of, like, how scared I am of spending money that I'll later regret. Like, I, I really, I know I don't come off as confident here, but that's not... Honestly though, I seem so inconfident about my server, but like, I, I'm, I'm super confident that I'm gonna be putting down a server that's gonna be of quality. The, the thing I'm scared of is the amount of players that'll be on the server. Like, I need, I need like more YouTubers to, to acknowledge that they're gonna be helping to work towards getting players on the server um, by showcasing like what the server has so far, like what the server has to offer and what it will have to offer in the future, which is, you know, again, that's like not every YouTuber will want to do that. 
which is understandable. But yeah, I, I just I want to be creating a community that actually that actually does well, and just overall a community that somewhat like you know like Hypixel mini games, like how Hypixel has their mini games, but just just different and just better just i i want i want to create unique takes on some game modes i want to create new game modes and i want to make new systems new settings or whatever like whatever the, i'd like i want to be a server owner that also really listens to the community very hard like i want to be one of those server owners where you can be like hey you know that's that that's something that's bugging me on the server could you please fix that? And I would try my best to fix that if that's actually an issue on the server. Like, the, that's the kind of owner that I want to be. It's, 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 uh, you know, I, I think you guys understand. Also, I don't know if you guys could tell, but I did not at all have an idea on what I was going to say this video. So, um, I know things are probably very messed up. Like, I probably brought things up twice, etc. But, yeah, um, outro. Uh, I just realized I don't have an outro. Ugh, I just said that, and I don't have an outro, so, um, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the black screen.